na chikahan kasama ang isang multi-awarded actor, director, at ngayon ay big time star maker ng Net 25 Star Center. Let's welcome direct Eric Pizzo! Eh, siyempre, mga kasama ko kayo, nakakayaan mo kung mabango ako. That's why we love him. Being around him. Kasi lagi siya mabango. And lagi pogi. Max. Come over, come over, direct. Upo po tayo. Direct, Eric, we are honored to have... Bago sa fa. Yes, to have you with us. Masarap ni ba, malam po? Bago na ba? Kuha sa EBM convention. Direct, kumusta? I am okay. Napakabinsi na ba ng iyong buhay? Medyo. Kasi parang nagtayo ako ng skwelahan eh. Parang ganun eh. So, hindi naman. So, right now, we're very busy with the workshop. So, it's not your usual workshop na acting lang. Hindi. Ano talaga to? Yung proseso talaga. Parang kinompress namin ng isang one-year program into a summer program. Well, of course, it's not summer. Mukulan. Pero... Parang ganun siya, yung pang, uh, yung pang summer classes na buo yung, ano, yung schedule mo. Di ba? Minsan pag nasa school ka, kumuha ka, kumuha ka ng mga 15 units, mga yes. ganyan. So dito para mga 21 units. Agad-agad ang dami. In a matter of three months lamang. Yes. Oh. Kasi po mga kada, si Direk Eric, siya po ang head ng Net25 Star Center natin. At bilang head po ng, stars, uh, ng ating Star Center, What is your typical day like kung ganun ka kahetik ka ka ng price yung 12 months sa 3 months lamang? Well, What, it's, it's it almost start? every day. Do you start like early, super early, ganyan? Are you like us, the morning, oh, <laughs> morning, okay. morning tea? Parang ating ko kaya ngayon kasabay <laughs> sa umaga. Hindi ah, okay. <laughs> nila ako nakikita. Eh. Pero minsan late ako. Hindi na ako kaka mag-comment ka rin. Ikaw na yung ika... Ito yung ika-apat namin co-host. Ikaw na yung ika-lima. Oo. So you're an early bird yourself. I am. I wake up at 4.30, 5.30 in the morning. So then I exercise na bago ko pumunta dito. So ang typical day talaga namin, kasi like I said, iba-ibang araw, iba-ibang schedule namin. Hindi lang puro acting eh. So... We, at first, we started with, uh, because we wanted to immerse them muna, because they're all new. So, un inuna namin yung imaging. Yeah, okay. Inuna namin yung imaging. Pagkata What does that mean? Imaging, okay. kasi syempre, uh, imaging and personality. So, kailangan nating buhayan ang personalidad ng bawat uh, okay. isa. Parang personality development. Yes. To, oh, oh, to, oh. You're helping them come out of their shell, diba? Well, we got, we got instructors to to, uh, to do, do that. It. Yeah. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. I think so, isa sa kanila yung nag-guest natin, si Karen Yeah, Ibasco. Karen Ibasco. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Kasi uh, I've worked with Karen before. Tsaka magaling siya dun sa ganun talaga. Okay. So may, may, ano, may ano siya talaga. Kumbaga parang meron siyang uh, program. Program ka tawag dun or... Uh, Uh, module, module for for that, and then of course, bago ko din sila sinalang sa acting, styling na kasi I think important yan and brand because like I said, what uh, what I've been telling everyone is that uh, gusto ko kasi yung mga kids, yung mga star center talents, I want them to be not just a singer or an actor. Gusto ko sila maging brand on their own. So. Yun ang, yun ang, yun ang uh, big goal. Parang kailangan oh, din natin mag-enroll dito, ha? Ah. Direct, kasi hindi naman okay. namin iraral itong okay. mga gantong bagay. Direct, Eric, parang na-chambahan oh, lang. Oh. Na <laughs> <laughs> on the spot lang talaga lahat. Hindi, kasi of course, syempre, it comes with experience, eh. Di ba? Okay. Like, not all of us are, are given the chance na ganito. To prepare. Since they're all neophytes and most of them are really new, oh, oh. so sabi ko, they have to go through this para pag sinalang natin sila, prepared sila. Meron ba yung sabihin ng branding, for instance, parang tututo ka sa isang quality mo, tapos ito yung tututukan mo lamang, ganun. Parang identity could be, mo, ganun. Could oh, be oh. that, because you can be known for something that yes. you are good at. Okay. Diba? But branding in a way, because like, I wanted to be like a household name, na parang, ay, oh, oh. si ano to, ay si ganito. Si Pia Guanyo, ganun. Oo, oh, oh, parang ganun siya. Parang, ano ginagawa niyo? Pag sinabi ko na rin, kasi Pia Guanyo, magaling yung mag-host. Parang ganun. Well, that comes with... So you stick to one 
skills. Skills. Okay. Well, right now, make it really, really yes. good. Right now, we're looking for kung saan sila mahusay. Ayon. Para si tignan mo muna. Yeah. Because it's so magkano din na you'd be like a jack of all trades and you can do anything. You can sing. You can dance. You can act. So, but then you'll get as an lost. actor, kasi, oh, mm -hmm. no, 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 I don't think you'll get lost. Mm -hmm. Because remember, ang training sa America, iba ha. Mm -hmm. Most, makita mo sila, you jackman, mga ganyan. Mm -hmm. Isipin mo, artista sila, but they can sing, yeah. they can dance. Yeah. So, I want them to be like a total performer and then find their niche later. Ayon, okay. So, so parang ganun. Hahasain sa lahat ng bagay. Yes. Tapos mag-isolate ka ng isa. Kung saan mo gusto, kasi at the end of the Para day. Para lilitaw. Mm -hmm. Yeah. At the end of the day, kung ano yung gusto mong gawin. Kung ano yung mahal mong, mas mahal mong gawin. Mm -hmm. So, yun, dun ka mag-excel. But mm -hmm. better to excel in all. Ako, mas gusto ko ready, yung ready, ready, ready. Para pag Emma, born na ready. Ready, ready. Ready. ready pag sinalang ka. Anything. Anything. Yeah. Yes. Ano. Yes. Kaya, kakanta po si Emma. Kakanta si, at this point, kakanta na po si Emma. Dahil born ready po siya. Okay, okay po. Ah! Direct. Mama, Mama. Wow, born na ready. Ready na po siya. <laughs> Pero Nag-voice lessons. Tapos willing din mag-acting workshop. Ginagawa namin niya. Meron kami voice lessons. Meron kami speech. Dancing. Kasi for 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 hosting. May dancing, may acting. Galing. So imaging, styling, branding. Saan ko ba nag-enroll dito? Ano oras ko? Try natin. Training ng makasama kami. No, usually talaga. Usually talaga Mondays, Wednesdays, and Saturdays. Ang, Mondays, ang, uh, Wednesday, workshop. Saturday. The whole day. And then in okay. between Tuesdays and Thursdays, minsan merong uh, uh, may, may meeting or may pinag-uusapan or may mga pinaplano. Oh, so, oh. yeah. Nakakatuwa na dere kasi before siguro, ikaw ba yourself, did you go through workshops like this? I did. I did. When kasi, you were younger? Okay. When I was younger kasi, of course, I was privileged enough na You saw it in your own home. Kaya yeah. ako may yeah. workshop yun eh. Manunod ka lang ang pamilya. Wala ka sila na yeah. makatawa. So, Lahat sila marunong umati. So, nung, tsaka nung time kasi na yun, uh, of course, yung mga kapatid ko na iba, nag-artista na sila. Uh -huh. Pero ako kasi nung time na yun, nagmamodel ako. So, 16 pa lang, nagmamodel-model na ako noon. So, uh -huh. nung nakita ko ng dati ko sa... Oh, Magazine. ikaw ba to? Sabi ko, yes, dad. Pagbukas na ng TV, oh, ikaw yan, ah. Sabi ko, yes, dad. So, pagkatapos, <laughs> nagkaroon na siya ng idea na kunin ako. Eh, so, tamang-tama, si Richard Gomez, mm, hindi pwede. It had pwede. to take other people to convince your dad na meron kang nakaya. Meron kang sinurprise mo siya. So, siyempre, at the time, it was mostly based on how you look. Parang ganun. Oh, 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 oh. That was in the 80s. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, nung time na yun, hindi pwede si Richard Gomez. So, sabi ng dati ko, sino bang pwede? And then my manager, Dolor Guevara, who was working for RVQ at the time, said, eh, Mang Dolphy, ba't hindi na lang po yung anak ninyo? Sino? Si Eric, o ayan po siya, nasa cover ako ng Mr. and Miss. Wow! So, so yan pa, dyan na nag-start yung big break? Dyan na yung, oo. Pero pagkatapos yun, ayaw ko pa because I was very reluctant, uh -huh. ayaw ko mag-artista. Ay, ano gusto mo? Kasi nung no, 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 una, sabi ko, ang baduya. Snooty <laughs> Ito ka na. Sabi ko, tatsa sabi sa akin nung, ano, nung, uh, nung right hand man ng, ng dad ko noon, si uh, Mang Conde. Sabi niya, so Eric, so what do you want? Sabi ko, what's in it for me? Ang tanong ko. <laughs> eh, nung time, nung time na yun, wala akong kotse. So sabi ko, so, siyempre, I was uh, 18, ano? so siyempre gusto ko magkaroon ng kotse. Sabi ko, I want a car. Okay. Oh, okay. Bayad sa akin, kotse. So, hindi, hindi ba ako? Na siyempre, si siyempre umuo ko. So, I, I I mean, like, like I guess I was privileged enough na ganun yung sitwasyon ko. Oh, so, everything na was... Na pwede kang humindi. Oh, na pwede ako humindi. Kasi gusto ko maging doktor. May choices, doctor. may opo. Oh, oh, yun yung gusto mong oh, gawin. Oh, yun yung oh, yun gusto ko. Direk, hindi ka ginan ito ng daddy mo. Tapos, <laughs> Actually, siya ang may gusto mag-doktor ako. Ah, talaga. Oh. Nililis ka rin yan. Ayaw niya. Yung family namin hindi masyado. Oo. Oh. Oh, oh. Ayaw, okay. ayaw niya. Gusto niya makapagtapos kami lahat. Ayaw. Kaya lang, nakangako ako na sabi ko, oh, basta tapos kami yung pag-aaral mo. Sabi ko, yes, tato. Natapos naman ako. So, That's so cute. Kaya lang hindi na ako nag-doktor. Kasi, ang nangyari, I fell in love with my craft. Mm -hmm. na, in, na, 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 kumbaga na, na, napamahal sa akin yung trabaho ko. Oo. Oh, oh. so, na-inlove ka sa acting. Yes. So, mm -hmm. na kaya nung mga time na yon kasi nung una ko talaga nakita yung sarili ko sa TV, sa, sa pelikula, sabi ko, 
My God, ang sama ng acting ko. <laughs> Kaya gusto ko, gusto ko talagang batuhin yung screen. Oh. Kaya sabi ko, hindi, mag-workshop ako. So nag-workshop ako, I went through, uh, nag na, 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 na workshop ako kala Gina Alahar. Wow! Gina Alahar, the best! Luis Quillen, and Mia oh. Gutierrez. So Kaya the best. Naman. Oh. Kaya naman, big time din ang achievements ni Direk Eri. Yes. Kaya mga bata, makikinig kayo. Ang daming Best Actor Awards nito. Oh. May mga Best Supporting Actor mm -hmm. Awards din. Mm -hmm. oh. okay. Pero hindi ba mahirap ituro yung alam mo? Because it's one thing for you to to actually do it, but to teach it to others, hindi mo mahirap. Of like, for uh... me, they keep asking me, why don't you teach how to host? It's Okay, if you're, if you're a host and you don't have the knack for teaching or hindi mo iniisip na magtuturo ka, then it will not happen. You have to put your mind to it. That's one. Pangalawa, kailangan gumawa ka talaga ng module. You have to ano na kung ano yung uh, ituturo mo. Kasi hindi naman hodgepodge lang yung ituturo mo. So kailangan talaga, it has to be a module or pattern from uh, something that you've learned before na ituturo mo sa kanila. At ang pinaka-ano dyan talaga is you will reach a stage in your life when you would like to share or mentor. So I guess I'm in that stage already na parang sinasabing matanda ka. Citizens, for more kada umaga updates, i-click lamang po ang subscribe button at i-follow ang Net25 social media pages on YouTube, Facebook, and TikTok at pati na rin ang Net25 TV.